didn't see my last video, go check it out. I'm happy to see you. Absolutely. And this was an appointment that you set. Do you know what that means? <laughs> Not my happiness, which is great. But the fact you set this appointment, it shows growth. It shows initiative. It is proof to you ultimately and confirmation for me that you are dedicated to increasing the awareness of your mental health. And not just awareness, but you're taking steps to continue to thrive, to heal, to conquer, to succeed, all the things we usually want. You're doing it. And that's amazing because you are amazing. And I celebrate you. All of you. Okay. All right. So, for our session today, I want to take you through some empowering questions. And I have a couple other things I want to add into the mix. All right. Let's start here. Just relax your mind. Relax your body. I want you to focus on this cradle. We're going to use it as a form of gentle hypnosis. Okay? This will help you to settle yourself and be in this moment. Focus.
empowering question number one. I want you to ask yourself this question. I want you to repeat it. You're not going to necessarily consciously search for an answer. That's not the objective. I just want you to ask this question with the assumption that it is true. It is true about yourself. All right? Question number one. Why am I safe to be who I really am? Question number two. Why is it okay to like myself? Question number three. Why is it okay to love myself? Number four, why am I so happy being free? Let's take a moment. Focus on the cradle. Question number five. Why am I in control of my life? Question number six, why do I easily let go of things that I don't really need?
Question number seven. Why do I let myself be loved? Focus on the cradle. Yes, you have a question. That's absolutely normal. This session is to empower you, but it's also to relax you. If your eyes get heavy and you want them to close, that's totally fine. Focusing on the cradle is not just by sight. It's also by hearing. Okay. All right. Question number eight. Why do I live my life in harmony? Again, you're asking yourself these questions. And you don't have to go into investigative mode. Just ask it with the assumption that it is already true. And just exist with it. Question number nine. Why do I love being healthy and happy? I'd like you to focus on the cradle one more time, whether it be with your eyes, 
your ears, both one or the other. some work for you to do on your own, okay? I'm going to take these statements and email them to you, all right? I have your email address. What is it again? yourself reading them and I want you to listen to the statements okay and in each step you're doing it with the assumption that each statement is already true okay amazing to see you and I have no doubt that you will continue to evolve and I'm humbled to be part of the process but kudos to you because you're putting in the work I see you you're not alone and your efforts are not in vain. Be in the moment and keep expecting great things. With some obstacles here and there, that's life. <laughs> 
but you got this. And I got your back. Okay. All right. I'll see you next time.